Next tonight here to that emotional reunion for two brave little boys who fought off a carjacker when their mother ran into the house to grab a baby bottle. He stole the car with them still inside, but he was no match for those little boys. And here's ABC's Ron Claiborne. A mother in tears, but relieved. Two of her children shaken, but OK. A joyful but improbable end to a parent's nightmare. It began when a man stole Luis and Lucia Lozada's car with their three children inside. When I can't see the car anymore, I start shaking. What am I doing? What am I doing with my kids? Who's going to do something to my kids? The drama in San Antonio, Texas, captured on these police dispatch audio tapes. Three for a gold Nissan. Three kids and it got, got taken. Uh, last mail jumped in and took off with their kids. The kids are seven years old for the twins and 12 months old for the other one. But only a short while later, they were back, and what a tale they had to tell. I was kicking him. I was hitting him with the snake. That's right. One of the boys beat the car thief with a toy snake until he let them go, about 10 miles away near Maria Garcia's home. I got up to the door, and the little boy was shaking up, and he said, they kidnapped us, they kidnapped us. I said, well, come on in. You're okay. Fighting back has worked before. This Philadelphia youngster escaped by biting the man who snatched her. And now these quick-thinking Texas twins who had the courage and creativity to fight back with the only weapon they had. And tonight, police say they have identified a person of interest in the case. Ron Claiborne, ABC News, New York.